all right well good afternoon good day how you doing team fca it's glenn blackwell back at you um in this uh first day of july july the first and uh, if you notice this background here what a beautiful background i am in the state of wisconsin the city of madison and the background is lake mendota and then if you look over here this is the university of wisconsin's multicultural student center how about that if you went to a school and the student center was right off the lake uh what a beautiful scene you all what a beautiful scene um y'all have noticed my tongue tied there a little bit have on the shirt university of wisconsin badgers for those who haven't heard my son jonathan blackwell has made a commitment to play at the university of wisconsin and the reason that i chose to use this background this timing uh to uh communicate to you is this story is a story of faith um you know as a, a dad or uh, of course any dad or mom will want your child to kind of follow in your footsteps it's just a natural a natural thing that parents would want of course you most know i've played at the university of illinois and why wouldn't it why wouldn't i want to why wouldn't i want my son to go to the university of illinois and and uh and make a name for himself but god saw it fit for him to make a name for himself elsewhere and this story of faith happened with a good friend of mine who uh, Gardas Tate, who is, uh, he also does strength and conditioning with, uh, with Jonathan. So it happened last summer. Uh, him and his son, Joshua, were at the airport and they were traveling to Myrtle Beach. And just so happened, the son, Joshua, said, Dad, look at those coaches over there with the W on their shirt. I wonder if they're football or basketball. And so uh, Gardas said, well, let's go find out. He said, I bet you they're football. And Gardas said, well, let's just go find out. So they proceeded over there and uh, they met the head coach, Greg Gard. And he said, um, you know, my son and I had a bet. We want to know if uh, you, are, you guys are football or basketball. He said, no, we're, ba we're basketball. And so Gard says, oh, wow, man, you, uh, I have a client and his name is Jonathan Blackwell. Boy, you better get a hold of him for Tom Izzo gets a hold of him. And at this time, this particular time, a week before, Jonathan had took an unofficial visit to Michigan State. And we took pictures, and I sent those pictures to Gardas, and Gardas showed him these pictures. What a timing. And so uh, uh, from that point, uh, I, he, he gave me Coach Gard's number. I uh, connected with him, and, and just so happened, Coach Gard was at one of Jonathan's AAU games. And the rest is history. He fell in love with Jonathan's game, and there was a lot of connections. I said, man, we're not going to know Wisconsin. You know, there's that pride in me, that dad's pride. And boy, when we came up to this campus, it was a surprise once again. And so again, just a story of faith. I said that Jonathan's recruiting process will happen out of the ordinary. It will be supernatural, I said. And sure enough, that story uh, exemplifies just the out of the ordinary way in which God showed up. And so... Um, um, the last we talked, we were heading into um, uh, our, our uh, coaches, uh, a coach's breakfast that we had at Brightmoor. It was a success. Uh, we had over 65 coaches in attendance, and we had two dynamic uh, uh, speakers, Sam Riggleman and also Bakari Alexander, just, just encouraging the coaches uh, to be present in the lives of the young people that they coach. And then uh, in June, we had our first team basketball, FCA team basketball camp, which we had six teams who participated in it. Um, Brother Rice, Brandon, MLA City, Rochester Adams, Renaissance, and River Rouge. Um, so uh, you, 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 you'll hear more about it in the newsletter that I'll put out uh, for this uh, upcoming uh, month. And so just wanted to report to you, just wanted to uh, connect with you that all is well with FCA. Uh, you know, this month we also will be uh, planning for next year. Take this month and uh, meet with our board and uh, just talk about what 
23, 22, 23 looks like. And look forward to it. Also, again, thank you so much for your support, your belief and donations to what we do. Um, so I just wanted to take this time and, um, and uh, communicate to you while we uh, enjoy the rest of this. And uh, be blessed and have a prosperous day. Glenn Blackwell saying God bless.